Hey everyone, today we're going to be building this automation that replaces your $100 to $150 software that repurposes your TikTok content watermark free to any platform you want. You can set this up in 10 to 15 minutes. If you follow through the tutorial, it's going to be a simple and easy tutorial, no coding experience needed. It is going to be built on make.com that by the way the link to sign up to make.com is going to be on the description so let's get started okay once you're in make.com right here you are going to click here when it where it says create new scenario you're going to name your scenario whatever you want and then you're going to create a module and connect your tiktok account all right and for the module, you need to click watch TikTok video posts, okay? Create a TikTok connection. I already have mine connected. So you just connect your account right here. And for the limit, set it to two or three, okay? And then you need to put the schedule setting to once a day, okay? Every day. So you can set up a time where you regularly post, like an hour after you post. So let's say I post at 6 p.m. I'm going to set it up so it's uh, 7 p.m., okay? And then once you have your trigger, which is the most important part of your automation, you're going to go ahead and create a module named HTTP, okay? If you just look HTTP, click HTTP, and click Make Basic Auth Request. Okay, click OK well, or click close. Okay, the next step is going to be to go to rapidapi.com, which is where we basically need to get the API so that the video is converted to to no, to watermark free video. Okay, create a new account on Rapid API and go to the hub. Okay, once you create the account, it's going to take you to the hub and then you click search for APIs and you're going to type the following. You're going to type TikTok video no watermark okay once you once you type that you're gonna click up the first one okay the link to this is actually gonna be on the description of the of the video the next thing you want to do is you want to go to pricing and you want to go to the basic plan i'm already subscribed but it will it will say just a basic blue button and you will just cl click sub subscribe and it will basically give you 150 TikTok or TikTok repurposes repurposed videos a month. Okay, I don't know anyone who you, who uploads more than 150 videos a month. So yeah, just just I would just stay in the basic plan. You're gonna go back to Make and you're gonna click HTTP and it's gonna ask you to choose a key. Okay, I already have my credentials, but let's just add a new one. There you go. You see. Okay, create. And just like that, you have your credentials. That's not really important. And now we're going to fill up this thing, which is a really important part to get your watermark free video, let's say. Okay. For the first, the URL, you're going to go back here and you're just going to paste, copy and paste this right here. It's going to be the same for everyone. Just copy and paste this. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Now for the, for the headers. Or the method is always going to be get. Okay. Just create two headers now. Okay. Header number one is going to be right here. Right, right, right down here. Or right here. Okay. It's got, the first one is going to be X rapid a API key for the name. The second one is going to be X rapid API host. Okay. Now for the value part. You're going to go to to rapid API and you're going to go to code snippets, which is right here. You're going to look for the, for the part where it says headers. Okay. So as you can see, here's a rapid API key. You just copy, double click and copy whatever is on the, on the right side. I can show it because that's my API key. You will have your own once you create your plan. So yeah. Just copy that and paste it over to the value and then go back to rapid API host and copy the, the value, which is inside the columns. Okay. Just inside the columns, do not copy the columns because it won't work. Just copy what's inside and just paste it under the value. Okay. Pretty simple, pretty easy to follow. We're, we're done for the, for the headers. Okay.
Now you're going to go to query string and we, you're going to click add pa pa parameter. Okay. You're going to click name. And you're going to put URL. You're going to add the value, which is going to be your share URL, URL from TikTok. Just click share URL and it will just input it here. Okay. Now you're going to click parse response. Yes. And yep, we are basically done with the hard part and we are ready to test this module out. Okay. So the, what you're going to do to test this module is going to choose, click, choose where to start. And you can do just choose manually, click, choose manually. You're just going to select a, a, a piece of content you've done in the past. Okay. It's going to show you, show you the, all your videos, all the videos you have made. And it's going to list them up. You just click one from there and you're going to click run once. Okay. Okay. As you can see, we got back the, the request. Okay. We got back the data and as you can see, we have all the data. You're going to click the data and then data again. And where it says play, that's basically your URL for your watermark free TikTok. As you can see. This is watermark free. This is some video I made like a few days ago. Um, so yeah, then you're gonna create a new module so that you can get the file and upload it to other platforms. Just follow this. You're gonna click get a file and just gonna click this, you know, go click data. You're gonna go ahead and click data again, which is right here. And you're gonna click play. Okay. Once you do that. We can go over here and click add another, add another module and create a router. Okay. You can click here and add a router. Okay. Once you add this router, you're going to connect the platforms you want it to be uploaded to. So let's say I wanted to upload it to Instagram. Instagram. Actually, Instagram can only be done in Instagram for business. So yeah, connect your Instagram and click create a real post. You just connect your accounts. And then let's say I want to connect my Facebook accounts. Let's click Facebook. Facebook pages. Create. Upload a video. Okay. Just click upload a video. And that's it. Okay. Before you set this up, you need to set up a filter. So basically when you're creating reels, you will want them to be longer than 90 seconds because it will create an error in Instagram because Instagram doesn't allow reels with over 90 seconds. So we're going to set that filter up so that every TikTok I upload with more than 90 seconds, it doesn't go through this part of the automation. Okay. So. So you're going to set this condition and you're going to click the duration text operators. No, is you're going to go to numeric operators in one second, numeric operators, less than 90 seconds. Okay. 90 seconds or less, and it's going to go through this route. And then you just connect your Instagram and click video URL and just click data, data. And like I said, here is your URL, URL for your watermark free video you got from the, the thing. Okay. Now you just put your caption, whatever. I, I always set the caption to the, to be the same as, as TikTok, but you can just set up whatever you want. You can even put AI to create a custom caption for this. So yeah, once you set this up, you just close it or click. Okay. I'm getting this error. I don't know why, but yeah, just click, load your page and, and do all the sort of stuff. Okay. Facebook pages, same thing. Basically, I don't know why it's failing to load my data, but my other automation actually works, but yeah, it's the, the session that's not connected. Right. Just click upload a video. And this is what the HTTP is. HTTP, get a file, create that. Connect that, sorry. And the description, like I said, the same as whatever you want to put it here. 
Okay, just is this for you to be creative? It's not loading because of the because of the failed connection. But anyways, now we got basically an automation setup. Right now, as it is, it's pretty valuable already. But we're gonna make it even more valuable. We're gonna set a set an AI to create a video description for a LinkedIn post, which is like more or hard to get a rank on. Let's say. So you can't, you can't really use your TikTok descriptions on your LinkedIn posts. So we're going to set op an open AI module. Just click open AI and you need to click create a completion. And you're going to click module. I like to use just to be fast GPT 3.5 turbo system or just a 16K. Sorry, just click add a message and you click role user and just click the prompt you want to say It's like talking to ChatGPT. Just put it right here. Got to tell it how to format it for LinkedIn. Just going to click OK. Oh, and by the way, you need to create your key uh, on OpenAI and you can watch a lot of videos on how to do that. It's pretty simple, but yeah. After you that you do that, you're going to go here and look for, for the LinkedIn, LinkedIn module, like you see right here, create a video user post. And right here, like this set, the file is going to be HTTP, get a file title. You're going to set up whatever you want content. You're going to put, you're going to click choices and you're going to click message contents. Okay. Okay, and yeah, that's pretty much it. You you can set up, do the same thing with an AI for with another. I don't really like to add a title to my LinkedIn post, but yeah, just click main feed public, and that's pretty much it. Like I said, you can add more modules. So let's say I wanted to add it to my drive, I can add it to I can add the watermark free video to a drive. Just create upload a file, and yeah, like I said, the file is here. Just select a folder, you know. It's pretty simple. You could get pretty much very creative with this. The important part is really this part right here. That's pretty much it, guys. You just saved a bunch of money and time by repurposing your content. Hey, guys, that's pretty much it for today. Thanks a lot for staying to the end of the video. And if, like I said, at the end of the video, just sign up to, to make that come with the link down below in the description. Like, subscribe if you want to see more content like this. I post all sort of automations on a weekly basis. See you in the next video.